Cybernetics is a transdisciplinary approach for exploring regulatory systems their structures, constraints, and possibilities. Norbert Wiener defined cybernetics in 1948 as the scientific study of control and communication in the animal and the machine. In the 21st century, the term is often used in a rather loose way to imply control of any system using technology. In other words, it is the scientific study of how humans, animals and machines control and communicate with each other. Cybernetics is applicable when a system being analyzed incorporates a closed signaling loop, originally referred to as a circular causal relationship, that is, where action by the system generates some change in its environment and that change is reflected in the system in some manner feedback that triggers a system change. Cybernetics is relevant to, for example, mechanical, physical, biological, cognitive, and social systems. The essential goal of the broad field of cybernetics is to understand and define the functions and processes of systems that have goals and that participate in circular, causal chains that move from action to sensing to comparison with desired goal, and again to action. Its focus is how anything digital, mechanical or biological processes information, reacts to information, and changes or can be changed to better accomplish the first two tasks. Cybernetics includes the study of feedback, black boxes and derived concepts such as communication and control in living organisms, machines and organizations including self-organization. Concepts studied by cyberneticists include, but are not limited to, learning, cognition, adaptation, social control, emergence, convergence, communication, efficiency, efficacy, and connectivity. In cybernetics these concepts otherwise already objects of study in other disciplines such as biology and engineering are abstracted from the context of the specific organism or device. The word cybernetics comes from Greek kybernetic, kybernetic meaning governance, i.e., all that are pertinent to kybernau, kybernau, the latter meaning to steer, navigate or govern, hence kybernesis, kybernesis meaning government is the government while kybernets, kybernets is the governor or helmperson of the ship. Contemporary cybernetics began as an interdisciplinary study connecting the fields of control systems, electrical network theory, mechanical engineering, logic modeling, evolutionary biology, neuroscience, anthropology, and psychology in the 1940s, often attributed to the Macy conferences. During the second half of the 20th century cybernetics evolved in ways that distinguish first-order cybernetics about observed systems from second-order cybernetics about observing systems. More recently there is talk about a third-order cybernetics doing in ways that embraces first and second order. Studies in cybernetics provide a means for examining the design and function of any system, including social systems such as business management and organizational learning, including for the purpose of making them more efficient and effective. Fields of study which have influenced or been influenced by cybernetics include game theory, system theory a mathematical counterpart to cybernetics, perceptual control theory, sociology, psychology especially neuropsychology, behavioral psychology, cognitive psychology, philosophy, architecture, and organizational theory. System dynamics, originated with applications of electrical engineering control theory to other kinds of simulation models especially business systems by J. Forrester at MIT in the 1950s, is a related field. Topic. Definitions Cybernetics has been defined in a variety of ways, by a variety of people, from a variety of disciplines. Cybernetician Stuart Umpleby reports some notable definitions. Science concerned with the study of systems of any nature which are capable of receiving, storing and processing information so as to use it for control. A. N. Kolmogorov. The art of steersmanship, deals with all forms of behavior in so far as they are regular, or determinate, or reproducible, stands to the real machine, electronic, mechanical, neural, or economic, much as geometry stands to real object in our terrestrial space, offers a method for the scientific treatment of the system in which complexity is outstanding and too important to be ignored. W. Ross Ashby a branch of mathematics dealing with problems of control, recursiveness, and information, focuses on forms and the patterns that connect." Gregory Battison. 
The Art of Securing Efficient Operation lit. The Art of Effective Action. Louis Cuffignal. The Art of Effective Organization. Stafford Beer. The Art and Science of Manipulating Defensible Metaphors. With relevance to constructivist epistemology. The author later extended the definition to include information flows in all media, from stars to brains. Gordon Pask. The Art of Creating Equilibrium in a World of Constraints and Possibilities. Ernst von Glasersfeld. The Science and Art of Understanding. Humberto Maturana. The Ability to Cure All Temporary Truth of Eternal Triteness. Herbert Bruno. Their notable definitions include. The Science and Art of the Understanding of Understanding. Rodney E. Donaldson, the first president of the American Society for Cybernetics. A Way of Thinking About Ways of Thinking of Which It Is One. Larry Richards. The Art of Interaction in Dynamic Networks. Roy A. Scott. The Study of Systems and Processes that Interact with Themselves and Produce Themselves from Themselves. Lewis Kaufman, President of the American Society for Cybernetics Etymology <inaudible> 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 The term cybernetics stems from kybernets, cybernets steersman, governor, pilot, or rudder. As with the ancient Greek pilot, independence of thought is important in cybernetics. French physicist and mathematician André-Marie Ampère first coined the word cybernetique, in his 1834 essay Essay sur la philosophie des sciences to describe the science of civil government. The term was borrowed by Norbert Wiener, in his book Cybernetics, to define the study of control and communication in the animal and the machine. History Roots of cybernetic theory The word cybernetics was first used in the context of the study of self-governance by Plato in the Alcibiades to signify the governance of people. The word cybernetic was also used in 1834 by the physicist André-Marie Ampère to, to denote the sciences of government in his classification system of human knowledge. The first artificial automatic regulatory system was a water clock, invented by the mechanician Catesibios, based on a tank which poured water into a reservoir before using it to run the mechanism. It used a cone-shaped float to monitor the level of the water in its reservoir and adjust the rate of flow of the water accordingly to maintain a constant level of water in the reservoir. This was the first artificial truly automatic self-regulatory device that required no outside intervention between the feedback and the controls of the mechanism. Although they considered this part of engineering, the use of the term cybernetics is much posterior. Ktesibios and others such as Heron and Su Song are considered to be some of the first to study cybernetic principles. The study of teleological mechanisms from the Greek telos or telos for end, goal, or purpose in machines with corrective feedback dates from as far back as the late 18th century when James Watt's steam engine was equipped with a governor 1775-1800, a centrifugal feedback valve for controlling the speed of the engine. Alfred Russell Wallace identified this as the principle of evolution in his famous 1858 paper. In 1868 James Clerk Maxwell published a theoretical article on governors, one of the first to discuss and refine the principles of self-regulating devices. Jakob von Uexkel applied the feedback mechanism via his model of functional cycle function screes in order to explain animal behavior and the origins of meaning in general. <laughs> Early 20th century Contemporary cybernetics began as an interdisciplinary study connecting the fields of control systems, electrical network theory, mechanical engineering, logic modeling, evolutionary biology, and neuroscience in the 1940s. The ideas are also related to the biological work of Ludwig von Bertalanffy in general systems theory. Electronic control systems originated with the 1927 work of Bell Telephone Laboratories engineer Harold S. Black on using negative feedback to control amplifiers. 
Early applications of negative feedback in electronic circuits included the control of gun mounts and radar antenna during World War II. The founder of System Dynamics, Jay Forrester, worked with Gordon S. Brown during World War II as a graduate student at the Servomechanisms Laboratory at MIT to develop electronic control systems for the U.S. Navy. Forrester later applied these ideas to social organizations, such as corporations and cities and became an original organizer of the MIT School of Industrial Management at the MIT Sloan School of Management. W. Edwards Deming, the total quality management guru for whom Japan named its top post-World War II industrial prize, was an intern at Bell Telephone Labs in 1927 and may have been influenced by network theory. Deming made understanding systems. One of the four pillars of what he described as profound knowledge in his book The New Economics. Numerous papers spearheaded the coalescing of the field. In 1935 Russian physiologist P. K. Anokin published a book in which the concept of feedback, back affrontation, was studied. The study and mathematical modeling of regulatory processes became a continuing research effort and two key articles were published in 1943. Behavior, Purpose and Teleology", by Arturo Rosenbluth, Norbert Wiener, and Julian Bigelow, and the paper, A Logical Calculus of the Ideas Imminent in Nervous Activity", by Warren McCulloch and Walter Pitts. In 1936, Stefan Odobleya published, Phonoscopy and the Clinical Semiotics. In 1937, he participated in the ICS International Congress of Military Medicine with, Demonstration de Phonoscopy. In the paper he disseminated a prospectus announcing his future work, Psychology Consonantiste, the most important of his writings, where he lays the theoretical foundations of generalized cybernetics. The book, published in Paris by Library Malouin, Volume I in 1938 and Volume II in 1939, contains almost 900 pages and includes 300 figures in the text. The author wrote at the time that, This book is a table of contents, an index or a dictionary of psychology, for a great treatise of psychology that should contain 20 to 30 volumes." Due to the beginning of World War II, the publication went unnoticed the first Romanian edition of this work did not appear until 1982. Cybernetics as a discipline was firmly established by Norbert Wiener, McCulloch, Arturo Rosenbluth and others, such as W. Ross Ashby, mathematician Alan Turing, and W. Gray Walter one of the first to build autonomous robots as an aid to the study of animal behavior. In the spring of 1947, Wiener was invited to a Congress on Harmonic Analysis, held in Nancy France was an important geographical locus of early cybernetics together with the US and UK. The event was organized by the Bourbaki, a French scientific Society, and mathematician Zolom Mandelbrot (1899–1983), uncle of the world-famous mathematician Benoit Mandelbrot. During this stay in France, Wiener received the offer to write a manuscript on the unifying character of this part of applied mathematics, which is found in the study of Brownian motion and in telecommunication engineering. The following summer, back in the United States, Wiener decided to introduce the neologism cybernetics, coined to denote the study of teleological mechanisms. Into his scientific theory, it was popularized through his book Cybernetics, or Control and Communication in the Animal and the Machine MIT Press, John Wiley & Sons, N.Y., 1948. In the UK this became the focus for the Ratio Club. In the early 1940s John von Neumann, although better known for his work in mathematics and computer science, did contribute a unique and unusual addition to the world of cybernetics, von Neumann cellular automata, and their logical follow-up, the von Neumann universal constructor. The result of these deceptively simple thought experiments was the concept of self-replication, which cybernetics adopted as a core concept. The concept that the same properties of genetic reproduction applied to social memes, living cells, and even computer viruses is further proof of the somewhat surprising universality of cybernetic study. In 1950, Wiener popularized the social implications of cybernetics, drawing analogies between automatic systems such as a regulated steam engine and human institutions in his best-selling The Human Use of Human Beings, Cybernetics and Society Houghton Mifflin. In the Soviet Union, bourgeois cybernetics was initially considered a pseudoscience and ideological weapon of imperialist reactionaries. 
Soviet Philosophical Dictionary, 1954 and later criticized as a narrow form of cybernetics. In the mid to late 1950s Viktor Glushkov and others salvaged the reputation of the field. Soviet cybernetics incorporated much of what became known as computer science in the West, while not the only instance of a research organization focused on cybernetics, the Biological Computer Lab at the University of Illinois at Urbana-Champaign, under the direction of Heinz von Forster, was a major center of cybernetic research for almost 20 years, beginning in 1958. Topic. Split from artificial intelligence Artificial intelligence AI was founded as a distinct discipline at the Dartmouth workshop. After some uneasy coexistence, AI gained funding and prominence. Consequently, cybernetic sciences such as the study of artificial neural networks were downplayed, the discipline shifted into the world of social sciences and therapy. Prominent cyberneticians during this period include Gregory Battison and Axel Berg. Topic. New cybernetics In the 1970s, new cyberneticians emerged in multiple fields, but especially in biology. The ideas of Maturana, Varela and Atlan, according to Jean-Pierre Depay realized that the cybernetic metaphors of the program upon which molecular biology had been based rendered a conception of the autonomy of the living being impossible. Consequently, these thinkers were led to invent a new cybernetics, one more suited to the organizations which mankind discovers in nature, organizations he has not himself invented. However, during the 1980s the question of whether the features of this new cybernetics could be applied to social forms of organization remained open to debate. In political science, Project Cyberson attempted to introduce a cybernetically controlled economy during the early 1970s. In the 1980s, according to Harry's Jones 1988, "...unlike its predecessor, the new cybernetics concerns itself with the interaction of autonomous political actors and subgroups, and the practical and reflexive consciousness of the subjects who produce and reproduce the structure of a political community. A dominant consideration is that of recursiveness, or self-reference of political action both with regards to the expression of political consciousness and with the ways in which systems build upon themselves." One characteristic of the emerging new cybernetics considered in that time by Felix Geyer and Hans van der Zouwen, according to Bailey 1994, was that it views information as constructed and reconstructed by an individual interacting with the environment. This provides an epistemological foundation of science, by viewing it as observer-dependent. Another characteristic of the new cybernetics is its contribution towards bridging the micro-macro gap. That is, it links the individual with the society. Another characteristic noted was the transition from classical cybernetics to the new cybernetics that involves a transition from classical problems to new problems. These shifts in thinking involve, among others, a, a change from emphasis on the system being steered to the system doing the steering, and the factor which guides the steering decisions, and b, new emphasis on communication between several systems which are trying to steer each other. Recent endeavors into the true focus of cybernetics, systems of control and emergent behavior, by such related fields as game theory the analysis of group interaction, systems of feedback in evolution, and metamaterials the study of materials with properties beyond the Newtonian properties of their constituent atoms, have led to a revived interest in this increasingly relevant field. Topic. Cybernetics and economic systems The design of self-regulating control systems for a real-time planned economy was explored by Viktor Glushkov in the former Soviet Union during the 1960s. By the time information technology was developed enough to enable feasible economic planning based on computers, the Soviet Union and Eastern Bloc countries began moving away from planning and eventually collapsed. More recent proposals for socialism involve new socialism. Outlined by the computer scientists Paul Cockshot and Alan Cottrell, where computers determine and manage the flows and allocation of resources among socially owned enterprises. On the other hand, neoliberals such as Friedrich Hayek also mention cybernetics as a discipline that could help economists understand the self organizing or self generating systems called markets. Being a 
complex phenomena. The best way to examine the market functioning is by using the feedback mechanism, explained by cybernetic theorists. That way, economists could make pattern predictions. Therefore, the market for Hayek is a communication system, an efficient mechanism for digesting dispersed information. The economist and a cyberneticist are like gardeners who are providing the appropriate environment. Finally, Hayek also considers that Adam Smith's idea of the invisible hand is as anticipation of the operation of the feedback mechanism in cybernetics. In the same book, Law, Legislation and Liberty, Hayek mentions, along with cybernetics, that economists should rely on the scientific findings of Ludwig von Bertalanffy general systems theory, along with information and communication theory and semiotics. Topic. Subdivisions of the field Cybernetics is sometimes used as a generic term, which serves as an umbrella for many systems-related scientific fields. Topic. Basic cybernetics Cybernetics studies systems of control as a concept, attempting to discover the basic principles underlying such things as Artificial intelligence Computer vision Control systems Conversation theory Emergence Interactions of actors theory Learning organization Robotics Second order cybernetics Self organization in cybernetics Topic In biology Cybernetics in biology is the study of cybernetic systems present in biological organisms primarily focusing on how animals adapt to their environment and how information in the form of genes is passed from generation to generation there is also a secondary focus on combining artificial systems with biological systems. A notable application to the biology world would be that, in 1955, the physicist George Gamow published a prescient article in Scientific American called, Information Transfer in the Living Cell, and cybernetics gave biologists Jacques Monod and Francois Jacob a language for formulating their early theory of gene regulatory networks in the 1960s. Autopoiesis Biocybernetics Bioengineering Bionics Ecology Heterostasis Homeostasis Medical cybernetics Neuroscience Synthetic biology Systems biology Practopoiesis Topic. In computer science Computer science directly applies the concepts of cybernetics to the control of devices and the analysis of information. Cellular automaton Decision support systems Design patterns Robotics Simulation Topic. In engineering Cybernetics in engineering is used to analyze cascading failures and system accidents, in which the small errors and imperfections in a system can generate disasters. Other topics studied include Adaptive systems Biomedical engineering Engineering cybernetics Ergonomics Systems engineering In management Autonomous agency theory Entrepreneurial cybernetics Management cybernetics Operations research Organizational cybernetics Systems engineering Viable system theory Topic. In mathematics Mathematical cybernetics focuses on the factors of information, interaction of parts in systems, and the structure of systems. Control theory Dynamical system Information theory Systems theory Topic. In psychology Attachment theory Behavioral cybernetics Cognitive psychology Consciousness 
Embodied cognition Human-robot interaction Mind-body problem Perceptual control theory Psycho-cybernetics Psychovector analysis Systems psychology Topic. In sociology By examining group behavior through the lens of cybernetics, sociologists can seek the reasons for such spontaneous events as smart mobs and riots, as well as how communities develop rules such as etiquette by consensus without formal discussion. Effect control theory explains role behavior, emotions, and labeling theory in terms of homeostatic maintenance of sentiments associated with cultural categories. The most comprehensive attempt ever made in the social sciences to increase cybernetics in a generalized theory of society was made by Talcott Parsons. In this way, cybernetics establishes the basic hierarchy in Parsons' Agile paradigm, which is the ordering system dimension of his action theory. These and other cybernetic models in sociology are reviewed in a book edited by McClelland and Ferraro. Effect control theory Mimetics Sociocybernetics Topic. In education A model of cybernetics in education was introduced by Gihan Sami Solomon, an educational consultant, as a project idea to be implemented with the help of two team members in Sinai. The Sinai Sustainability Cybernetics Center announced as a semi-finalist project by MIT Annual Competition 2013. The project idea proposed relating education to sustainable development through an IMS project that applies a multiple educational program related to the original natural self-healing system of life on Earth. Education, sustainable development, social justice disciplines interact in a causal circular relationship that education would contribute to the development of the local community in Sinai Village, on both sustainability and social responsibility levels while the community itself provides a unique learning environment that will contribute to the development of the educational program in a closed signaling loop. Topic. In art Nicholas Schaffer's CYSPI was perhaps the first artwork to explicitly employ cybernetic principles CYSP is an acronym that joins the first two letters of the words cybernetic and spatiodynamic. The prominent and influential Cybernetic Serendipity exhibition was held at the ICA in 1968 curated by Jasia Reichart, including Schaffer's CYSPI and Gordon Pask's Colloquy of Mobile's installation. Pask's reflections on colloquy connected it to his earlier musicolor installation and to he what he termed aesthetically potent environments, a concept that connected this artistic work to his concerns with teaching and learning. The artist Roya Scott elaborated an extensive theory of cybernetic art in Behaviorist Art and the Cybernetic Vision, Cybernetica, Journal of the International Association for Cybernetics, Namur, Volume 9, Number 4, 1966, Volume 10, Number 1, 1967, and in The Cybernetic Stance: My Process and Purpose, Leonardo, Volume 1, Number 2, 1968. Art historian Edward A. Shankin has written about the history of art and cybernetics in essays, including Cybernetics and Art: Cultural Convergence in the 1960s. And from cybernetics to telematics, the art, pedagogy, and theory of Roy A. Scott 2003, which traces the trajectory of A. Scott's work from cybernetic art to telematic art art using computer networking as its medium, a precursor to net.art Telematic art Interactive art Systems art Topic. In architecture and design Cybernetics was an influence on thinking in architecture and design in the decades after the Second World War. Ashby and Pask were drawn on by design theorists such as Horst Riddle, Christopher Alexander and Bruce Archer. Pask was a consultant to Nicholas Negroponte's Architecture Machine Group, forerunner of the MIT Media Lab, and collaborated with architect Cedric Price and theater director Joan Littlewood on the influential Fun Palace project during the 1960s. Pask's 1950s musicolor installation was the inspiration for John and Julia Fraser's work on Price's Generator Project. 
There has been a resurgence of interest in cybernetics and systems thinking amongst designers in recent decades, in relation to developments in technology and increasingly complex design challenges. Figures such as Klaus Krippendorf, Paul Pangaro and Renolf Glanville have made significant contributions to both cybernetics and design research. The connections between the two fields have come to be understood less in terms of application and more as reflections of each other. In Earth system science Geocybernetics aims to study and control the complex co-evolution of ecosphere and anthroposphere, for example, for dealing with planetary problems such as anthropogenic global warming. Geocybernetics applies a dynamical systems perspective to Earth system analysis. It provides a theoretical framework for studying the implications of following different sustainability paradigms on co-evolutionary trajectories of the planetary socio-ecological system to reveal attractors in this system, their stability, resilience and reachability. Concepts such as tipping points in the climate system, planetary boundaries, the safe operating space for humanity and proposals for manipulating Earth system dynamics on a global scale such as geoengineering have been framed in the language of geocybernetic Earth system analysis. In sport A model of cybernetics in sport was introduced by Yuri Verkoshansky and Mel C. Sif in 1999 in their book Supertraining. In law As a form of regulation, cybernetics has been always close to law, especially in regulation and legal sciences, through the next topics Organizations and superorganisms Ontology, logic and artificial intelligence Complex adaptive systems Smart contracts Control systems Self-organization in cybernetics Cyberethics Regulation Consensus systems Metagovernment Topic. Related fields Topic. Complexity science Complexity science attempts to understand the nature of complex systems. Complex adaptive system Complex systems Complexity theory Topic. Biomechatronics Biomechatronics relates to linking mechatronics to biological organisms, leading to systems that conform to A. N. Kolmogorov's definition of cybernetics. Science concerned with the study of systems of any nature which are capable of receiving, storing and processing information so as to use it for control." From this perspective mechatronics are considered technical cybernetics or engineering cybernetics. See also Notes References Topic. Further reading Arbab, Michael A. 1987. Brains, Machines, and Mathematics 2nd ed. New York, Springer Verlag. ISBN 978-0387965390. Arbab, Michael A. 1972. The Metaphorical Brain. Wiley. ISBN 0-471-03249-2. Escott, Roy Behaviorist Art and the Cybernetic Vision. Cybernetica, Journal of the International Association for Cybernetics Namur, 10, pp. 25–56 Ashby, William Ross An Introduction to Cybernetics PDF. Chapman and Hall. Retrieved 3 June 2012. Beer, Stafford 1974. Designing Freedom. Chichester, West Sussex, England, Wiley. ISBN 978-0471951650. Francois, Charles Systemics and Cybernetics in a Historical Perspective. In, Systems Research and Behavioral Science. Vol. 16, pp. 203-219 George, F. H. Cybernetics. Teach Yourself Books. 
ISBN 0 340 05941 9. Jarevich, Slava. From Newspeak to Cyberspeak A History of Soviet Cybernetics. Cambridge, Massachusetts, U. A. MIT Press. ISBN 0 262 07232 7. Himes, Steve Joshua. Constructing a Social Science for Postwar America, The Cybernetics Group, 1946-1953 Cambridge, Massachusetts U. A. MIT Press. ISBN 9780262581381. Himes, Steve Joshua 1971. The Age of Information, An Interdisciplinary Survey of Cybernetics. Englewood Cliffs, N.J., Educational Technology Publications. ISBN 9780877780. Himes, Steve Joshua 2002. Cybernetics and Second Order Cybernetics, in, R.A. Myers, ed., Encyclopedia of Physical Science and Technology 3rd ed., Vol. 4, Academic Press, San Diego, p. 155-169. Heotiniemi, Heike Neocybernetics in Biological Systems. ESPU, Helsinki University of Technology, Control Engineering Laboratory. Ilgos, Hans Joachim Norbert Wiener, Leipzig. Johnston, John the Allure of Machinic Life, Cybernetics, Artificial Life, and the New AI. Cambridge, Massachusetts, MIT Press. ISBN 978-0-262-10126-4. Medina, Eden Cybernetic Revolutionaries, Technology and Politics in Allende's Chile. Cambridge, Massachusetts, MIT Press. ISBN 978-0-262-01649-0. Pangaro, Paul. Cybernetics, A Definition. Pask, Gordon 1972. Cybernetics. Encyclopædia Britannica. Patton, Bernard C., Odom, Eugene P. December 1981. The Cybernetic Nature of Ecosystems. The American Naturalist. The University of Chicago Press. 118 886-895. Doi 101086 283881 JSTOR 2460822 Pekulis V 1974 Cybernetics A to Z Moscow Mir Publishers Pickering Andrew 2010 The Cybernetic Brain Sketches of Another Future Online AUSG Ed Chicago University of Chicago Press ISBN 978-0226667898. Umpleby, Stewart The Science of Cybernetics and the Cybernetics of Science, in, Cybernetics and Systems, Vol. 21, No. 1, 1990, pp. 109-121, Von Forster, Heinz, 1995, Ethics and Second Order Cybernetics. Wiener, Norbert Herman and C., ed. Cybernetics, or, Control and Communication in the Animal and the Machine. Paris, Technology Press. Retrieved 3 June 2012. Wiener, Norbert Cybernetics and Society, The Human Use of Human Beings. Houghton Mifflin. Topic external links General Norbert Wiener and Stefan Odobleja, a comparative analysis reading list for Cybernetics Principia Cybernetica Web Web Dictionary of Cybernetics and Systems Glossary Slideshow 136 slides Basics of Cybernetics. Archived from the original on the 11th of August 2010. Retrieved 23 January 2016. What is Cybernetics? Leave us short introductory videos on YouTube Music Mailman, Joshua B. 2012. Seven Metaphors for Music Listening, Dramatic in Journal of Sonic Studies Vol. 2. Mailman, Joshua B. 2016. Cybernetic Phenomenology of Music, Embodied Speculative Realism, and Aesthetics Driven Techne for Spontaneous Audiovisual Expression in Perspectives of New Music Vol. 54, No. 1-5-95. Societies American Society for Cybernetics IEEE Systems, MAN, and Cybernetics Society International Society for Cybernetics and Systems Research The Cybernetics Society